Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Midwest Market Solutions Insider Commentary. It is Thursday morning, September the 1st. Turn the calendar here to September. We've seen a little rally in the grains overnight ahead of the export sales report this morning. The expectations are we'll see a, a very strong report for corn soybean exports, but it should be down from recent weeks as uh, we've not seen as many private sales here recently. Now, we did see some support yesterday morning from a host of private sales, one in corn, one in soybeans, one in wheat for the first time in months. But uh, demand faded for grain products as the day wore on and prices slipped lower into the close. Now we're certainly oversold and due for a bounce. We hit contract lows in Chicago, Kansas City, wheat and in corn yesterday. And uh, in soybeans it was a new low close for the move. In fact the lowest on the continuation chart since last April and the sixth consecutive lower close. So we're due for a bounce. We may see a little bit of a rally in here, but with harvest coming on, I think traders will continue to look at rallies as opportunities to shed market length and uh, we'll wait to buy in aggressively until we can establish harvest lows, which are it's just way too early to think we're going to do that. Um, looking at bigger picture, the ADP numbers that came out yesterday, they were certainly reinforcing the fact of we're going to likely raise interest rates at some point this fall. Could be this month in September, could be most likely it's going to be later and possibly into December after the election before the Fed raises rates. But with the likelihood that we're going to see an increase in rates that's going to keep strength in the U.S. dollar and will also work against grain exports and grain prices. Um, so we got exports out this morning. Corn margins were lowered, and that'll be effective as of today's close. And as we look ahead to this weekend, it's Labor Day weekend, and uh, it's going to be very wet in parts of Florida and on the East Coast because of a hurricane that is crashing onto the coast this weekend. Markets will close for Labor Day, and on Sunday night we'll have no trade. No trade on Monday until Monday evening. We'll come out with our newsletters as normal. We sent out our hedge program newsletter uh, yesterday, our trade update newsletter last night, and uh, we've, we're still short corn. We've got cattle spread on and a host of other ideas and market uh, ideas that we are advising our clients to take advantage of. So if you want to get copies of those, make sure you uh, follow us on Twitter and Check us out at our website where you can sign up for a free trial, MidwestMarketSolutions.com. Call any of our six offices. Have a great day, everyone. This has been Brian Hoops from Midwest Market Solutions.